What's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. Today, we're going to be opening one of the type of tins I've never opened. Another type of video. I opened the Eternity tin, but this one's a different version of a tin. The Vaporeon. As you can see, there's three Jolteon, Vaporeon, and Flareon. I think I like Flareon the best. Mm, Vaporeon second, and Jolteon third. Sorry, Jolteon. But these are the Gen 1 Evolutions. There's the promo right there. And this thing is still sealed. Got from Pokemon Center. You know what I that I put. <laughs> but it's time to crack into this, guys. Never opened these types of tins up before. Really excited. Got some other stuff coming too for you guys. Also, happy Valentine's Day. Hope you're having a good Valentine's Day. Getting good pulls like I'm going to get. We almost got it off, guys. There it is. Yoink. All right, let's crack into this, guys. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, got that. Ooh. But we do got this promo right here. Look how majestic it is. Uh, why do they do it like this? It's a bit annoying. But that's a beautiful card. Now, is that even how you do it? Wait, what's that? Did I just do that for nothing? Oh, they, they, oh why did they do it like that? Though? But we do got this tin. Last time I checked, they do have some... I know what booster packs are going to be in here, but they might reprint it or something. I don't know. But look at that. Did get new sleeves in, guys. Yoink. The new clear one so I can see my card's condition, you know. I'm gonna put that in. See this? Put it in the sleeve like that. And look how majestic it is. Let's see if it has good condition for a promo that I just took out. Ah, there's a bit of whitening there. Oh, I just took it off like that. Uh, not bad, not bad. A bit of whitening. And it's a tiny, tiny, tiny bit. But that's a really beautiful card. I don't know. It's really hard to choose between. But we take this stuff out. Ooh, I like that pack down there. Look at that. But we do have the code card for you guys. And we got four booster packs. Let's see if Jimmy's hidden anything. Another... Under it, you can hide anything. No, but you can get an evolving skies, a chilling pain, a bale slough, and a sword and shield base. We never opened this. What day is this pack? 2000 and wait, wait, does it even show that? No, 2020. We can save this pack for that. Get lucky on that. But let's start off with chilling pain. Now, listen here. You need to give me a hit at least once in your lifetime. I think I saw it. Ah, solid green, of course. Chilling rain always betrays us. Yeah. I have no idea when I'm actually going to get a hit. I've been opening a bunch of Chilling Rain from every stuff I've been opening. No hits from Chilling Rain, ever. Like, you guys don't understand. This set contains so many alternate hours or like, and a gold Snorlax I need to pull. Up. Just need to pull it, but it's just not going to happen. Larian, we got a Leaf Energy and Seabold back there. Hands are getting so buttery. Expedition Uniform. Oh my goodness. Lapras. Oh, I actually did get this in McDonald's form. <laughs> Blitzel. Aaron. Dearly. Goodness. Oh, Deli Bird. Stunny. 
Yeah, spare too. I have that. Oh, wait. I don't think I have that. Oh, we got battle styles next from the back because we don't want to see. Oh, oh. I don't think I cut the cards so though. Did I? No, I didn't. Yeah, I just. Oh, hold on. How do I see all this? Oh, what? Why is that? Ah, oh, no! Well, that's what happens when you get too overconfident. Come on. Come on. I mean, these are the. We have two bigger packs coming up, though. I mean, Sword and Shield, or, you know, no Trainer Gallery yet, but we do get, you know, Evolving Skies. Psychic Energy. Ooh, Hunch Crow. Ooh, Seedra. I feel like that. I've seen that before. Weeping Bell. Bell Style. <laughs> Yeah, but I thought I, like, I thought I saw a green and white code card. Maybe my eyes are tricking me. Look at Tom. Zubat. Ramoray. Onyx. But we did get a Weeping Bell, don't have that either. And did get an Onyx and a Reverse Tool Jammer. Gonna go from the back again, but this time it's Evolving Skies. Come on. Come on, Evolving Skies. But is this the reprint or not? That's the bigger question. Card for you guys on the evolving skies. We need to get some good look on this set. One, <laughs> two, three, four. We got a psychic energy. Lombre, Rapid Strike Squirrel of the Flying Dragons. Which flying dragon is that, guys? I think you know. I think it shows it on the artwork right here. Yeah, that's Flying Dragon. That's Fletch Finder. Let's put Fetch there for a second. Cutie Fly, Pikachu, for my boy Pikachu in the background, those two guys back there, Applin, Lillipop, Amolga, it really feels like there's more than 10 cards in this pack. That's actually 11 because of an energy that you get. I don't think that's gonna hit. Baldor. Reverse. And. Ooh, a hollow Dialga. No way we struck out on it. It's actually the non reprint version, which is really nice. Oh, wait. <laughs> Those are the. Ten Where is it? Where oh, there it is. Oh, yes, it is. I'm. That means I'm going to be buying more of these. That's a nice hollow. Could be worth over a dollar. Could be. Could be. Some hollows are worth over a dollar, but not that many. But we're going to sleeve that thing up. Oh, what? I, the, okay, so Dialga and Palkia are tied for my maybe third favorite Pokemon card. Not Pokemon card. I mean, Pokemon. But I am trying to pull those from Ash Radiance and Crowns in it. Oh, but we already pulled one from Ash Radiance, so thanks to our boy Pikachu's. Why is it the hollow that's harder? I think because I'm excited to open up that Sword and Shield pack. Ooh. Sorry, that was my head bump. I can't roll it. Oh, goodness. It won't fit. Hold on. Let me try that. Ah! It's 
so slippery. Spending most of the, oh. Spending most of the video just on this. Whoop. Put that guy in. Here we have our Diaga Hollow. But we did get this Vaporeon, so that's really nice. But we got one more pack. Don't fail us. Please don't fail us, Sword and Shield Base. My first ever... Um, oh, I didn't even cut it all the way. And I just shake it like that. But good luck. So this is the oldest set that's going to be in here. These are Sword and Shield, Base Set Pack, Code Card, Fire Energy, Bisharp. Uh, no, these and these are all new cards that I don't have, which is really nice. Family Buttery <laughs> Drizzle, Rotom Bike. I'm getting so wobbly, and I think that's the food right there as the mouth. Full picks, Pin Kirchen, Pin Kirchen. <laughs> Hoot Hoot Mud Bray Ah But we did get a group Oh wait I think really they copied it from Shining Face as an artwork Stone to Nerd V Max Let's go Let's go guys Swing Shield Base The pack I haven't opened Is the one to give us The goodness Not bad Let's go Swing Shield Base Did better than Evolving Skies on us So so far I mean it's the same thing As I asked the Pikachus for 3 hits Not the ones I wanted But that's still Great a hit from Sword and Shield base set is always good because that's the hardest set, actually. Because there's no Trend Galleries in this set. But we did get the Stone Junior Remax. Really weird Pokemon to see Remax, but hey, we pulled it. So it's overall, really fun thing to open. Didn't make our value back, but we did get some other stuff. So we got this Stone Junior Remax. Really interesting card. They Orion V and his Diaga Hollow. That's gonna be the end of the video. Make sure to like and subscribe with notifications on, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!